IoT devices are usually connected to the global internet network, directly or indirectly. There are various methods of how to connect IoT hardware to the network infrastructure, yet following the most common scenarios, there are wired and wireless connections. Due to the nature of the IoT devices, most of them use the wireless one. Once IoT devices was, were born, the Internet was already existing and being quite a grown idea, to it is natural that principles of the networking communication were adapted from the Internet to the IoT world. Naturally, the networking model on the Internet is composed of the layers, the so-called ESO OSI model, and this model was also adopted by the IoT solutions. Many IoT devices, however, are unable to implement the full ISO OSI stack, as in example PC hardware and operating systems can. Many of the end node IoT devices are too constrained on the matter of CPU, RAM and storage to implement full networking stack. So there are devices solutions for IoT networks parallel to the regular ones. Moreover, using regular ESOC stack, sometimes it is far too power consuming and requires a continuous connection between the devices. As a full stack contains seven layers, here we will use a simplified approach describing it in two groups. One is called media layer and this group is composed of the three low level layers including physical, data link and network layers. The second group is composed of the remaining four high-level layers, starting from transportation through session and presentation, finally to the application. Specific IoT communication methods and its implementation frequently break this model, but generally most of them somehow follow layered approach.